Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Yoon Jung-min. South Korea continues its battle against extreme heat, which some areas have seen ear-high temperatures of nearly 40 degrees Celsius, while high temperatures are expected to last until next week. As the risk of heat-related illnesses is on the rise, our Song Yoo-jin reports on ways to stay safe during this sweltering weather. South Korea's capital city Seoul on Tuesday experienced its hottest day of the year so far, with highs reaching 35 degrees Celsius. In Hwasunggun County in Jeollanam-do province in the south, the mercury soared to 37 degrees Celsius. According to the Korea Disease Control and Prevention Agency, as of 4 p.m. Tuesday, at least 13 people have died from heat-related illnesses this year, like heat stroke, heat exhaustion, and heat cramps due to the prolonged heat wave. That's more than two times what was reported in the same period last year. However, the figure is likely to be even higher as some cases reported to local fire departments have not yet been included. Experts warn that the elderly and people with existing heart or blood vessel conditions are at risk in particular. So what can be done to prevent heat-related illnesses? First, avoid going outside during the hottest time of the day, which is between noon and 5 p.m. People working on farms or in confined spaces like greenhouses should be on high alert. It's not just about the absolute temperature, but also about how long for and where you're exposed to the heat. Even at the same temperature, the risk of heat stroke or heat exhaustion cranks up if you're exposed to the heat for a long time or working in a confined, humid environment. If you can't avoid outdoor activities, try to schedule your work outside these hours and work in a group so that you can ask for help in case of an emergency. Second, drink plenty of water. If you've been sweating a lot, a sports drink might be a good option as it not only keeps you hydrated but also helps maintain your electrolyte balance. Third, move to a cool place if you feel unwell. Dizziness, nausea and headaches are common symptoms of heat-related illnesses. Find some shade, drink water, and if you still feel sick, don't hesitate to reach out for help or go see a doctor. Song Yujin, Arirang News.